Uh, I think just physically trying to stay as healthy as I could over the summer. Last year was pretty grueling towards the end of it, trying to push into the playoffs. So just staying healthy and um, I'm another year older. So just trying to make sure I'm prepared to play and ready for day one today. So um, that's probably the biggest thing I did, just to take care of myself over the summer. Uh, you mentioned playoff push. Obviously, you know, the Comets are used to making the postseason. So how much does that fuel you and some of the guys that are returning to get this uh, franchise back in the postseason for the ECHL? Yeah, yeah, no, I think it's everything, honestly. I think there's a reason um, a lot of us came back. I think the guys that did come back were kind of the guys that were all on board last year. Um, unfortunately, there was a lot of turnover with our team last year, so it was tough to kind of get a team and a solid nucleus together um, for portions of the year. But uh, these guys that came back, I think, really believe in what we're doing here, and me included, and um, I think we're all chomping at the bit to get going. Personally, how do you reflect on last season? Obviously, you know, uh, you had 80 points, you were the team MVP. Uh, when you look back on your individual performance, how do, you, how do you rate it, and what do you take away from that season? Yeah, yeah, no, it was a good season. Um, individually, I, I did what I uh, set out to accomplish, but ultimately I think, um, at least for me, I just – enjoy winning. I like to win. I think um, I can be a, a big help to that, but um, you know, I don't really go into a season saying I'm going to get 80 points this year. It's more so just I'm going to do whatever I can to, to help us win. And a big part of that is me producing offensively, but you know, some other parts are maybe sticking up for the guy next to me who got cheap shotted, and I'm not afraid to do that either. So whatever I can do on any given night, I try to do my best at, and I'm hoping to do the same this season. Um, how would you describe this roster? Obviously, you haven't gotten on the ice all together as a unit until this afternoon, but how would you describe what, uh, what Dave Franke and what these guys are bringing in as a team so far? Yeah, yeah, no, I think they did a great job um, over the summer kind of targeting the guys that they wanted to get, and obviously um, they all did their job and pitched what they wanted to hear, so to get them here, and um, I think we have a great team. A lot of, like I said, all our guys returning, we're all, we're all our – top guys or guys that really wanted to be here, which is a huge part of it. And we obviously went out and signed some pretty big free agents. And um, kind of like you said, you don't really know until you get out there and get things rolling. But on paper, at least, we have we have quite a, quite a team. So um, I'm excited to see how that all pans out throughout the season. Yeah. Final question, what are you most looking forward to for this upcoming season? Uh, just being back in the building, being back on the ice, uh, being around the guys, that's kind of always been um, a big thing for me. I <clears throat> love hockey because you get so close with your teammates, and um, especially in a year like I'm, you know, we're hoping to have this year, you can really count on the guy next to you, and he turns into a brother, and um, you know, you go a long way, and you can do something special, and you constantly keep in touch with guys like that the rest of your life. So um, I love that about hockey, and obviously I love playing. It's my favorite thing to do, and I'm just looking to have fun and be competitive and be a good team. Good deal. Anything else you'd like to add? Uh, go Comets. I think that's about it.